F1 discussing replacing Russian GP with Circuit Lewis Hamilton called boring. Formula One could replace the axed Russian Grand Prix with a second race around the Marina Bay Street Circuit in Singapore to ensure the record 23 race 2022 season is completed. It is just one of a number of ideas mooted after the Sochi Autodrome was dropped as a venue amid the Russian invasion of Ukraine, leaving F1 in need of another track to host a Grand Prix. The Russian Grand Prix was set to stage the 17th round of the season on September 25 as the season approaches its climax. However, the race was suspended and then cancelled entirely after Russian President Vladimir Putin launched his military attack on Ukraine. The Sochi race was originally scheduled as part of a triple header of races along with Singapore and Japan. However, Speculation is suggesting Singapore could now host events on both September 25 and October 2 before moving east to Suzuka. Rumors suggest the first weekend of the doubleheader in Singapore would be raced earlier than tradition, with the second weekend retaining the usual 20 hundred hours slot. The plan is gaining steam due to the course's favorable location, while it would also alleviate some of the recent concerns regarding F1's freight movements. The news of a potential doubleheader in Singapore might not be welcomed by seven-time world champion Lewis Hamilton, who has labelled the race as boring as Monaco to watch. The Brits' comments came after he finished P4 at the Singapore Grand Prix in 2019, which was won by Ferrari's Sebastian Vettel. Hamilton urged event organisers to add more overtaking spots to the track to avoid worries of the event becoming like the Monaco GP, which despite its immense history, intrigue and glamour, could be removed from the calendar. Hamilton said, this unfortunately, it is a really beautiful place that we come to and it is such a great track, but it is worse than Monaco almost. Was it as boring as Monaco to watch the trace? Maybe we need to change the last corner so we stop in a hairpin and we have a tight hairpin to go around. The current, last corner, you cannot follow and it is a sequence of five quite fast corners that come up after where you never get close. That will make it even more special this track maybe. However, Qatar remains an enticing option for F1 officials. Here, the Qatari Sovereign Wealth Fund, holds a 17% share block in the Volkswagen Group, which has been considering entering F1 for a while. The company are yet to commit Audi and Porsche to the sport amid discussions, and an extra race in Qatar could prove to be a key bargaining chip for F1. Qatar has been linked with the vacant September 25th slot after the country hosted its first ever Grand Prix last season, ahead of embarking on a new 10-year deal from 2023. The chief concern over a race being held in Qatar at that time of the year is the extreme heat with temperatures pushing 40 degrees, which is why other tracks are being considered. The 22 race F1 2022 campaign, which is expected to return to a record 23 races in the near future once a Russian Grand Prix replacement is found, continues with the Emilia Ramanga Grand Prix on April 24. <laughs>